we're in the middle of nowhere, right? I mean, where are we? We're in the middle of nowhere, Utah, is where we are. But there's gas wells everywhere, and there's oil wells, and it's, you just feel just the presence of industry all around us. It's just everywhere. Yeah. Uh, it's a pretty, pretty interesting place to be. So we're with the Picaro team, and they are finding uh, methane readings pretty much everywhere we go. Right. Put tension, and then we'll switch the inlet and see what happens. And it's in the in the in an area that's what 50 by 50 miles. Mm -hmm. So 2,500 square mile area, they're finding um, just kind of constant readings. After this turn, we entered the gas fields. Shortly thereafter, the uh, amount of methane increased substantially, a factor of two to three times higher. I didn't expect to see oil and gas rigs oh. about you know, half a mile apart everywhere you look. They're just everywhere. There's one there, there's one there, there's one there, there's one there. Here, here, there's fracking that looks like going on behind us. I don't think people understand where this is going on. It's really in a very remote part of the country. Right. And you don't see regulators driving around. What you see are huge trucks that are part of the production system. So it's just, it's interesting how isolated much of it is. I see a lot of trucks, a lot of vehicles, a lot of people, but no regulators. It's just, it's oil and gas uh, employees. Mm -hmm.